So this week, the government introduced telehealth. Has anyone tried telehealth yet? I'm very, very interested to see how this whole process works. Apparently, it's 10 years worth of work just crunched together and they did it in just a few days. Can you believe it? So now we've got this up and running in our nation. So we can, uh, you know, any patient can contact a GP and have a consult over the phone. Like, this is this is earth-breaking stuff, particularly for Australia, because we're usually behind in this sort of bizzo. So <clears throat> I, I've looked it up and, you know, New South Wales um, Government Department, they've got lots of information about it. So you can, you know, click on, on these things that you need and you could find a doctor that, that provides the service. And I think you can, you know, order scripts and all sorts of things. So it's really opened a whole new world for us as, you know, in terms of visiting the doctor. So, wow, I can't wait to use it. I have actually asked my doctor, but um, that was last week I asked him. Sorry about that. Um, and, you know, he said, no, he wasn't going to be doing it. But I'm sure there's heaps of doctors out there that are going to be doing it. So I'll be seeking out one of those doctors for my next consult. Just ring through and then they're going to, they'll ring you back. And, then, and you know, you can, you can do it. So this is, this is pretty good. And you know what? When I took, um, uh, you know, my new rescue cat, when I took her to the vet on Saturday because of, you know, we can't have any contact with people and, and so forth. So they've got a, this whole procedure going on for for taking uh, your pet to the vet and you don't actually see the vet. So you have to do this sort of weird drop off in the foyer and then the vet comes and takes it. And then the vet rings you while he's examining your animal and talks you through blah, 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 tells you what's happening, asks you questions. And then the consult finishes, they put you through reception, you pay, and then and then you do this weird pickup situation as well, back at the foyer. So, yeah, there you go. We d don't really sort of need any human contact now when we can, uh, you know, go to the doctor and not even have to have a human contact. It's quite incredible. Anyway, I think it's a great initiative. So, well done, ScoMo. You really have done a lot of great things coming out of the coronavirus crisis. I mean, you've done some pretty crappy things as well, some really bad stuff, and I'm not impressed. But it, yeah, there's a few things, but you know what? Your app, your government app, guess what, ScoMo? It, the, the news section hasn't been updated for two days. Two days! So it's time to delete your apps, guys. If you got them, not so great. Press delete, get rid of it. You know, what did we expect really? Did we really expect to have, you know, the latest updated thing going on? Not really. Stay at home, guys, and stay healthy.